That's right, Nick. Come sit down next to me. Have a nice little time chilling here while I explain what's going to happen in this video. Alright, so thank you guys for tuning back in. And last video, um, I corrected that whole Macho Man Randy Savage uh, Deathclaw uh, returning the egg doodad. And this one guy, I can't pronounce his name, in TWA Damila, um, told me that while I'm there, I should go check out Lynn Woods. He wants me to do it in a specific way. He says, Sam, you are too high speed fucking retarded. Nick didn't like sitting next to me. He got up and went over to the other bench. What, do I smell bad or something? Fuck you! He wants me to go over to Lynn Woods, sneak my way up to the tower. He said, he said Sam, you are just too stupid to do this. You're going to kill everything, but you have to sneak up the top of the tower. And you'll see a circuit switch up top. Flick it on and enjoy the show down below. That rhymed. I'm not sure if that's intentional or not. Oh, and try not to let Nick fuck you up fuck you up by getting noticed. Maybe do a, and then it, it says read more, but I, f I forgot to click that. <laughs> Alright, anyways. So let's, let's go to Lynn Woods. Oh, uh, yeah. Alright, so, uh... By the way, this is like the main entrance to this place. I don't think I've ever been out here. Well, Jesus. It's raining hard. Okay, I'm not shitting you right now. I'm using Google Maps to find Lynn Woods. I can see the Saugus Ironworks is an actual place. Lynn Woods is an actual place. The Lynn Police Department. I see Nahant on here. There's a municipal golf course. And it, it seems to be in between two little river lake things. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> Anyways, Lynn Woods is uh, directly left of this. Apparently, like, maybe the bombs dropped and altered the coastline a little bit or something. But uh, this ain't the same looking place as it is on the Google Maps, so I had to... I had, I had to use a regular Fallout map. Did they really set this guy up looking at a wall? That's rude, dude. All right, so that's the the guy told me about a stone tower. That's the stone tower. It looks like the Leaning Tower of Pizza. So I'm gonna go do that. Get up there, bing the bop. No one will be the wiser. And uh, I gotta save before I go over there because apparently it's sneaky deaky stuff, and I suck at that. And this guy's shit talking me about it. And I'm, uh, frankly, I'm not, I'm not even sure if I'm going to put up with that kind of attitude. Hurt my feelings. I'll save it anyways, though. I keep getting calls from my freaking family while I'm trying to work here. I mean, I wouldn't really call this work. I'm getting paid for it, but... <laughs> it's not exactly work, but still, they're pestering me. And it's an annoyance. Here's we got to use this little hump on the ground to just do a 360 no-scope over the... Okay. What you gotta do is just use the stairs, jump over them, and walk up. That wasn't hard. Acting like I'm all retarded and shit. Jesus. People don't have any faith in me, man. Hello? I bet there's someone up here. It's, remember Skyrim? There's always someone up at the top of the, the thing. Oh, there's no one up here. Pulse grenades. That sort of shit. Who's fighting who down there? Oh, shit. Alright, hold on. Let me flip the flop. Oh, lordy! I see something coming. I might just have to... Oh wow, this is this is hooting and hollering oh, territory. Hold on a second. Hold on a second. You know, we're gonna just do a, a field v fifty on this one. Hey, let's let's get some slow mo going on. You know what I'm saying? I've seen a lot of things in the wasteland. None of them as glorious as that moment. As that siren sounded, fifty raiders formed an offense armed with nothing but machetes and melee weapons, took on the baddest beast in all of the wastelands, crippled its arms and legs, and obliterated its will to survive. In those moments, they were not just raiders. They were testaments to human survivability, our tenacity, and our indestructible will to survive. You can throw what you want at us, Wasteland, and we will fight it back off. You can't.
cannot win. This would be a touching story if it were true. Because there weren't 50 men there. There was two. And they got fucking murdered in like 10 seconds. Oh, guy tore out that guy's fucking arm. Oh! Ah! <laughs> that was gnarly. That was that was fantastic. Oh, is there another one out there? Oh shit, there is. <gasps> Legendary Alpha Death Claw. Running away like a fucking two dollar bitch. Oh, apparently he was doing some ripping and tearing I didn't even know about. Damn, dude, he, he tore this guy up. Deathclaw? Hey, buddy. No need to act like a little scaredy cat. Lights out for you. Is he running? Uh oh. Yeah, this one over here. There we go. Okay, we got it. Okay, we're good. You still want to save my life? <laughs> yep. Fucking hold still, guy. There we go. As long as it's fighting that, I should be good. Those things have a lot of health. Yeah, this is fucking easy. Look at that. Took like two. So oh shit, it's still alive. I'll let it finish off all the, the Meyer lurks and then I'll turn it around. There we go. <laughs> I got time for this. Let's see what this guy has on him. Does 50% more damage against animals. I'll take it. And an 8-ball. I'll take it. That was exciting. So I wonder what constitutes an animal. Is that like anything that just ain't a person? You know? Picking up on putting down Nick? Well, I, I never really checked out what this guy fucking ripped up over here. Yo, he went to him, I can cheese on the one guy. He ripped off, his legs were gone. And then he just like picked up his body and said, uh, Nay, sir. Nay. That's what he said to him. I heard it. They didn't really have much in their uh, their little huts, anyways. How would they even live here? There's death claws right around the corner. They should have seen that in the first fucking ten seconds of them living here. Apparently, up here there's a what? Where did these guys come from? Come on, let's see if there's any more of these. They just came in out of nowhere as soon as I started huckling the buck up here. Let's see if they can. I can get more death claws. The sounds of silence. Any more? Any more want to come play? No. All right. Supposedly, all this blood up here is supposed to lead to a uh, settler that's at the top of this thing. And he's supposed to have the key. Like his body's supposed to be right here. I think. And it's supposed to have the key to that master steamer trunk. But he ain't spawned here in my in my thing. Well, I mean I'm supposed to get a key for the steamer trunk, man. I, I kinda wanted to see what was in it, just saying. Alright, well I guess uh I guess I, I this little puddle full of bodies just kinda fucking cracks me up, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> that's that's one of the more gruesome things I've seen in this game. Anyways, uh I guess now I don't know what I should do. Alrighty, I'm all dressed up and ready to go. But next episode, I'll be doing the. Uh, hold on, what do we got this? Meet Deacon at the old highway, doing that uh, railroad stuff. Go hang out together. By the way, have you seen those videos? All the evidence of uh, Deacon following you since you got out of the vault. It's fucking weird as hell, man. Like, there's every when you first go to Good Neighbor, he's there. When you uh, get out of the vault, 
um, a little bit down the road, he's there. Like he's uh, and he's in these disguises, like all these different places. He fucking he follows you throughout the game until you get to the railroad, and which is why he vouches for you when you get in. He knows all the stuff you've been doing, and the video I watched also there's a place right outside the vault where he was just watching you like watching the vault he there's one of those little shadow marks or whatever those things are called for the railroad and uh, it said like ally on it and there's this place where he would sit and just wait for the vault to be opened it was weird man like dudes it's a, lot, it's a lot of work it was weird it's kind of weird me out a little bit I think I, I'm starting to not want Deacon anymore I think I want Curie I don't know. Anyways, thanks for watching. This is General Sam. Next episode, I promise you, will be more interesting than this one. It's kind of pressed for time when I recorded this. I apologize, I'm embarrassed. Alright, later.